Tell us how homecoming and the festivities will be different this year. So the festivities will be outside this year, and due to the circumstances, it's limited to the spectators at the game. So the ceremony might be virtual. We don't know until it gets closer. What will go on outside and when? Um, it is going to happen on February 11th, which is a Thursday, and it's going to be during homeroom. And depending on the weather, we're going to have different um, things going on. So we are going to have sled dogs if it's snowing, and disc golf, snowman building, snowball toss through tires, and hot chocolate for sale as a fundraiser for the food pantry. And if there's not enough snow, we're going to have backup plans for more games to play. How do you sign up to participate? So you can sign up during the lunch hours with the senior board. Um, you sign up with your name and put your grade next to it so we know how to count the points. Are there any other requirements? The participants um, must submit a signed permission slip in order to go outside on the day that we have it. And you must also wear proper winter attire since we're going to be outside and it's going to be cold. And if you don't have that, you won't be able to be in. All right. What are the indoor activities? So this year we're going to have the same hallway decorating and that'll take place on Sunday, February 7th at noon and that's only for the board members. And we'll also have the Spirit Week dress up like we always do. Tell us about the dress up days. So for Monday we're going to have Western Day. Tuesday is going to be Lazy Day which is pajamas. Wednesday Essential Worker Day and then Thursday is going to be red, black, and white like always and also with wacky hair. Alright, now back to the main desk. 